Hello everyone, welcome to our first live workout at 5.30. I'm on a few minutes early, reason being is I need to share it across to all of our different pages. So I've got my phone here, I'll do that right now, and the work off will kick out, kick off around 5.33, nice long stretch, followed by some isometric work, a little get to know you, and then as we move on, as we move forward, the workouts will get more and more complicated, and if Ryan and Brody, who are watching right now, would like to do one, they are more than welcome to. So just so you know, when you do come on the video, I can see who's watching, so say hello below, and more importantly, can you hear me? Give me a thumbs up. So let me just share all these videos now, and then we'll kick off. Brody, comment. Ryan, comment. Say something. Where is, where are we? Okay. So now I'm sharing it onto all of our pages. So, so I don't forget, we'll start with uh, Cardiff. And then we're going to share it to, we've got so many pages. Even sometimes I get a little bit confused. Hello Ryan, hello Tanya, hello Aileen. Oh, it's Cardiff, now Adams Town. Stephen Cooley's on. Steve, Stephen Cooley loves to chat. Part of these workouts is to interact with our members and you guys. Steve will go back and forth with you all day long. So get on. Okay, so Cardiff, Adams Town. Okay, I'm getting distracted. Let's go... We're on, we're on Wall's End. Let's go Curry Curry. Aileen's from Curry Curry. Thank you for joining us. Uh, and of course, we've got to go to Warner's Bay. Uh, and then we've also got to go into all of our groups. So as you can see, we post three or four hundred times per day and it's quite complicated because even I forget sometimes just how many pages we have and how many members want to jump on, say hello, Mitch, say hello to Tanya, to Aileen, to Steve, to Brody, go back and forth. So when I'm stretching, I obviously can't comment back, however, I can talk your ears off while you guys comment amongst yourselves. So, into the groups. <sighs> okay, so Cardiff, it's in there, Adamstown, it's in there, Walls End, Warners Bay, and Curry Curry. So, I believe it's in all of our groups now. Hang on. Let me just double check. Now, once I'm in the groups, I'm going to make sure my Instagram is also up. So, we're in all the groups. Okay, give me a second. Hello, Linda. How are you? How is your plantar fascia healing? It might be a good idea. It might be a good opportunity to rest that heel. Hello Nelly, I didn't know people over the age of 60 were allowed to use Facebook. Kelly, how are you? Was that a bad joke? If it is, just tell me Nelly, I don't really mind. I'm bound to say lots of silly things. The more you talk for hours and hours and hours on end, no one can be perfect. So now I'm just setting up my Instagram live. As promised, my dogs are in the background. Okay, so it is... We're going to start our workout in about two minutes, guys, so just bear with me. Okay. So, we are... Hey, get, hello, Mel. Linda, I'm great. Uh, that's a lie. It's been a, nightmare of a last, <laughs> it's been a nightmare of a week, but we'll get through it. There are far, far worse things. Oh, hey, Mitch. How are you? Good to see you there. Oh, Steve, they always look good. Years and years and years of boot camp. Hello, Diana. If we can get 50 people on here, Mitch actually said tomorrow night he's going to do a live with his shirt off. How good would that be? But I also thought in a few days we could get Brody on for a live and we could try and find her a new boyfriend. So imagine Brody's there doing a live, stretching away, doing her exercises, and then maybe the 10th comment or the 20th comment on the post would win a date with Brody. And currently, because we're all in self-isolation, that would mean a Skype with Brody. Okay, 
Throw on Instagram. We've got four people on Instagram. We've got 49 people watching. Bloody hell! All right, guys. So tonight, as I mentioned, it is going to be a little bit of a stretch, followed by some isometrics. All I want you guys to do is just watch, comment along, and start. We're going to start with our calves, our Achilles, and our soleus. Working up to our hamstrings, our quads, our glutes. We'll get nice and limber. And then from there, we'll do some isometric work. Okay, so start with the groin. Who's stretching? Say hello. So Brody's. Oh, I'm not that hard on anyone. Hello, Amory. How are you? Hey, Simone. Oh, Nat, I miss Linda too. I really, really do. How are you? How are you? Renee. No, keep your shirt on. You're talking to me or Mitch. I'm, that hurts my feelings. Definitely a strategic move by Steve. You're going to have to follow that up. We're at 51. I can see that, Brody. Thanks for being anal retentive as normal. All right, guys, into a groin. We're going to hold each stretch for 20 seconds. Is Mitch's shirt already off? That's weird. Jake! Belle, how are you? I miss all you guys. Okay guys, we're gonna go into a hamstring. So I'm gonna come back a bit. We're gonna come down here, reach forward for a good 30 seconds. So this isn't all about jokes. This is important. Mobility, flexibility will enable you to exercise for a longer period of time. The other thing static stretching is really, really good for is to just relax, calm down, and de-stress after, after a long day. Hey, Beck, how are you? Please tell me how that ankle's going. Change legs, guys. Steve, I can't help the lighting placement. You've been in this room many, many times. It's the best I could do. Hello, Josh. Hello, Grace. Dave. It's been far, far, far too long. What I want you guys to do is, I want you to comment below if you guys have any muscles that are sore, any joints that are sore, comment them below and I will show you how to stretch them. All right guys, change again. So each time we change, le change legs, sorry, we should be going a little bit further each time. Yes, Diane, you can access this workout later. The fact that you train 15 times a week, you might be able to skip, sit this one out. Hey Kylie, how are you? How's life? Okay, so Nat Brings has, a, has tight hamstrings. So, Nat, what I'm doing right now is a hamstring stretch, but we'll do another one after this. Okay guys, change again. So, these lives, also comment below, these lives, what do you want these lives to be? They can be a nutrition Q&A, they can be a supplement Q&A, you can literally ask me questions about anything, uh, they can be injury Q&As, Kylie Gray's at work, well, you probably shouldn't be on your phone, Kylie. Alright guys, so Nat, four hamstrings, we're going to sit out in front, we're going to grab, hang on, sit out in front, we're going to grab both legs like that, from here guys, we're going to hold this for about a minute, and every so often, take a deep breath and come lower and lower into this movement. So Brooke Page's shoulders are sore because Steve gave her a 16 kilo kettlebell. Steve claims to be the friendliest guy in town. That isn't very friendly, is it, Brooke? Nutrition is always a good one. Simone, I'll keep that in my back pocket and we will do one of them uh, later on. So guys, now that is your hamstring stretch. So, so far we've switched out our groins our hamstrings. What we're going to do guys, we're going to come into a quadricep stretch. So come back like that. If you can, lean back as far as you can. We shouldn't have any pressure through the front of our knees. If you're wondering why I'm sitting in a very dark room, this is actually my home cinema room. It's my pride and joy. There's a speaker up there on the wall and a projector up there. This is where Steve comes once a month for all of our UFC events. Karen Martell has a tight lower back during a kettlebell swing. I'll go through that in a second, Karen. Change legs. So typically with a tight lower back, during kettlebell swings, it's not actually your lower back that is tight. 
it is the execution of the movement. So Karen, I'll get you to send a video to Brody of you doing a kettlebell swing and we can address that. Quite often you're swinging your back too much and you're not hinging with your hips properly. That might seem very complicated, but we can fix that very quickly. Change again, guys. Diana's talking. It's a stress relief for me. You don't understand what this household is like with three children, 24 seven. Diana, I've got two dogs behind me. Sparkles, Lily. Sparkles, Lily, come on. I'm also very stressed out. Here they come. Come here. Come here. Oh. There's Lily. So, in terms of stress relief, you can definitely stretch with your dogs. In fact, I actually encourage it. Justin Coulton is watching. Justin was one of our first 25 ever members. Change legs, guys, at Curry Curry. And I've known him for years now. Nice paint job. That is correct. Justin actually painted this room for me. That man never forgets a single thing. You'll be happy to know, Justin, that we painted our new Carter premises, premises all on my, all on, not my own, our own. The whole team helped out, Steve, Ryan, Brody. Mitch didn't actually do that much, do that much to be honest. Okay, guys, from here, our quads are done, our hamstrings are done, our calves and our groin is done. We're going to go into a glute. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna bring your leg over, bring your arms in, and pull your leg nice and tight like that, and just give your leg a big hug. Brody just wrote, poor Lily. It's not poor Lily. I rescued her. I saved her life. She owes me a debt of gratitude, which I'm going to hold over her head forever. Tracy McDonald is watching. Tracy is one of our older members at Curry Curry. Tracy, I hope you're doing well at this time, you and your family. Ryan's watching. I babysat those dogs a few times. They have licking, sorry, they hate licking people in the face. That's just not true. All right, guys, change the legs up. Justin gave me an LOL. Yes, I do consider myself to be quite humorous. Ryan uh, and Brody are actually our babysitters for our dogs when we go away, which is very good. Andrea Bramble, my three told is telling. That doesn't make any sense and I'm a bad speller. I can read bad spelling. Okay guys, from here, we're gonna externally rotate our hip. Like this, we're gonna come up like that, and all we're doing is we're gonna sit in that position like that. Hello, Mr. Hey! Hang on. Ignore them. Someone just got home. Uh, hey! That's the best thing about. Hey! Stop it! Hey! Go outside! Hey! Change up. That parking's nice. Now stretching our leg, guys. As you can see, they're guard dogs. So come back around, guys, to our other leg. We've got a few more stretches, guys, and then we'll start exercising. Andrea Brown was apologizing for her kid. That's just not right. Aileen Rose, is Ryan watching? Ryan never stretches, in case you see. He doesn't move like he should. <laughs> Change up, guys. Last time. Uh, Ellen is stuck at the courts with coronavirus. They are still open. And I imagine at times that these crime does go up, unfortunately. Okay guys, come up into a hip flexor. So what we're gonna do, we are going to sit up like this and we're going to lean, step out and lean out. Your hip flexor quite often, often is interpreted as one muscle, but your hip flexors externally rotate your hip. They internally rotate your hip and they are responsible for hip flexion and abduction, which means leg out to side. So when we're stretching our hip, we want to go through those ranges of motion. Guys, come on. Right, guys, lean forward. So Mitch, Ryan and Brody, who's doing the live tomorrow night? I'm dying to know. Ow. Entire firm is working remote now. So all of my all of your legal problems guys, you can send them over to Stephanie McCulloch. She can do that. The lighting is really
good. Like that was an accident, or it's really bad and you're being sarcastic. I'm not actually sure. Ellen just got home. It's actually our four year anniversary, believe it or not. And I told her to wait. Oh, I'll be out in a second. Nav is on. Brody bags not. Brody is not running the next live. However, what Brody is doing tomorrow morning, she is definitely running a cooking. Uh, sorry, not running. She is doing a cooking video. Justin, great work, guys. Do miss the family. We miss everyone. Your dogs are sending my dogs off. Sorry, Claire. <laughs> Change legs, guys. This will be our last stretch, and then we do some glute work. Followed by some core work. Oh, thanks, Diana. Four years today in isolation. Because I pushed her back for this stretching video, I'm not sure there's going to be a fifth anniversary. Let's hope there is. Maybe. I'm not sure. Okay, guys. Lean in front. I still have to answer Brooke Page's question about having a sore shoulder. What I might do, Brooke, I might do some shoulder exercises along with some glute work. So we'll, get, we'll come to that towards the end. That's a spoiler to ensure you, you keep watching. Okay, guys, step over. So from here, rotate your sternum and lean that way. So currently right now, we are in internal rotation on our right leg, the leg that is on the ground. Tammy Howard, how are you? We've been often credited with unbelievable memories. And I remember I met Tammy Howard. It would have been September 2015 on a Friday night in the Curry Girl Guides Hall. Tammy wanted to start boot camp. However, she had a bad knee. We sent her off to the physio. A lot's happened since then and I can still remember that. I'm sure Mitch does too. Okay guys, so from here, we're gonna come down into our first exercise. We're going to do a plank, okay? So we come up like this, arms down, butt straight, core nice and tight. Like that, we're gonna hold that for 45 seconds. I actually haven't got a timer, so, hang on, I'll get a timer. All right, 45 seconds. So we're into a circuit. We're into a circuit of a plank, 45 seconds, we're going to do a glute bridge, 45 seconds, and then we are going to do some T's and Y's, which are the shoulder exercises that will help Brooke or anyone with any kind of niggling shoulder injuries. We want to address the imbalances that lie in her shoulder. Typically, it's through the upper back, her scapula, rhomboids, serratus anterior. Not just a pretty face. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Alright guys, come over into a glute bridge. So, exercise is quite often performed incorrectly. So what we're doing guys, we're holding this position here. However, we are not holding that position. And we're not holding here. What we're going to do is, we're going to go into a posterior pelvic tilt. We want to tuck our tailbone. What that means and looks like is, so we're going to tuck our tailbone, squeeze our glutes. We're going to hold this for 45 seconds, starting now. That's not the best look. Keep going in. Thirty seconds to go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so guys, we're going to our Y's and T's. What a Y and T is? We're gonna lie down like this. Shoulders out in front into a Y position. All we're doing is we're coming up, lifting and holding like that. Like that. And back down. So we're going to do 25 reps. In three, two, one, let's go. 
Pumps are still flying in. Five to go. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, guys. Our last exercise is our T's. So just similar to our Y's. Our T's is out in front. You'll get the camera angles right with practice. Claire, it's my first live. Give me a break. In my lounge room. We might do this at our Carter for Adamstown location with some equipment in the future. But for now, this will do. So guys, our arms are out in front. We're coming up like that. And back down, guys. Just like our wires, but our arms are the shape of AT. Just like that. Squeezing our shoulder blades together. If anything, our shoulder blades are coming down and back, which is going to help the positioning of your shoulders when you move. 10 to go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. That circuit, guys, a 45 second plank, a 45 second glute bridge, a 40, uh, 25 reps of a Y, 25 reps of a T, three, three times around, followed by more stretching. Is it going to make or break your fitness regime? Absolutely not. With that extra mobility work, the stretching, and the activation drills, it can certainly help you stay healthy moving forward. Um, oh, Ellen hopped on. Hey, Ellen. So, I'm going to wrap it up there to so complete those exercises three times around. Tomorrow night at 5.30, we'll be live again. First one done and in the books. They will get better and better as we work out the camera angles, the lighting, the time, and how to do this moving forward. I'm glad you feel great, Linda. Thank you for watching. By the way, all I want you to do is like, tag a friend, and share this video. I see what you guys like, share, and tag. Some of you guys to the, go, to, go to the ends of the earth to win a six-pack of nuggets from KFC. You like it, you share it. You tag 50 friends to win a six-pack of nuggets. I agree with you, but nuggets are great. However, what's just as worthy is sharing this video so people in Newcastle can exercise while they're at home. It might help them, it might not, but at least it's a start. Thank you all for watching. We'll work out who's doing tomorrow night's live video. It might be me again. Hopefully it's someone else and we can see you face to face every single day until COVID-19 has passed and we are good to go. Thank you, everyone.